Live on your radio. Stream via the Nova player or play Nova on your smart speaker. This is Nova. I'm Marianne Harris. Good morning. The man accused of a domestic violence stabbing frenzy in Sydney has now been charged in hospital. 58-year-old Anthony Benson faces a string of charges, including grievous bodily harm with intent to murder. He's expected to front court on Thursday for a possible bail application. His partner and an injured bystander who stepped in to help remain in hospital. The federal opposition says Aussies do deserve a better deal when booking domestic and international flights. The government plans to create an ombudsman for the sector, which could force airlines to pay compensation for cancelled or unreasonably delayed services. Good health news now and donor hearts could be kept alive for 48 hours, thanks to new funding from the Queensland government. Overseas and Russia has launched hundreds of missiles and drones at Ukraine, killing five people, sparking power and water outages nationwide. President Volodymyr Zelensky has described the attack as sneaky and one of the biggest combined strikes targeting critical civilian infrastructure. And Australia's Paralympians will receive up to $20,000 for bringing home a medal in Paris as the federal government declares it will match the financial reward given to the country's Olympians. Now here's Mitch with sport. A good show from the Brisbane Lions with the AFL announcing a 44-man squad for the 2024 All-Australian team. Five Lions, the most of any team alongside Fremantle, were named with Cam Rayner earning his first nomination along with teammates Harris Andrews, Joe Danaher, Dane Zorko and our boy Lockie Neal. The squad will be finalised to 20 two players on Thursday. And the Rabbitohs will look to downgrade the careless high tackle charge against Cam Murray tonight, a fight that, if unsuccessful, will end the start lock season. The Bunnies have matches against the Panthers and Roosters before their 2024 campaign is over. The industry school connects with the world of education with the world of work. Enroll now for year 10 in 2025. Visit deliberatelydifferent.com.au. Plenty of fog hanging around again this morning, a mostly sunny day once it clears on the way to a top of 28 degrees. Right now it's 19 and you're up to date on Nova.